the smell of this road is so fresh. So fresh, so new, and only for me. Just like anywhere else, the ticket for a foreigner costs 100 baht, while for Thais it's 20 baht. But today there is some kind of special day, so Thais can come for free. Yeah. There is a benefit though, that I'm going later to visit a fish cave, to visit a beautiful lake called Pan Ong. Yeah. So I don't need to pay there, I just need to save this ticket and show it later. So still, 100 baht for three places, it's pretty cheap. I think so. So let's enjoy the waterfall, let's see what kind of waterfall it is. Beautiful but far, and there is no access to the waterfall itself. Well, if you can walk closer, I think it's a bummer. The place is beautiful, but I don't see a way, I don't see a path leading to the waterfall. Really, there is no way closer. A bit sad. Yeah, guys, you see, there is a stairs, but it's closed. There is like some kind of wooden gate, so you can get closer to enjoy the beauty of this waterfall. It's really nice, but you need to get closer to touch the water. But you can't. So this is it, and my hundred baht is gone. Okay. Okay. Keep driving. Guys, I gotta say, it was really fast. Probably the fastest visit of waterfall in the history of this channel. Or maybe in the history of my life. It's truly really fast. Let's check out what we can find by the lake. Maybe there will be something more interesting because even you guys have recommended me to visit this lake Pang Ong Lake Pang Ong Lake Food! Yeah! They've got food What food they've got here? Oh, Ahan, Ahan, Ahan <laughs> Okay, Kap, Kabun Kap Quick stop on the way to Pang On Lake. Yeah, I don't know the name of this place. I just stopped because I've noticed a guy with food. Yeah. Anyway, I just need five minutes to drop something in my stomach because it feels pretty hungry and it's not that easy to find a restaurant here. So it's just like unnamed place. Nevertheless, I will add the pin to this place into location, into the description of this video in case you want to repeat my route. Yeah. Yeah. So I finished the meal and we will continue driving. Okay. Okay? Yeah guys, this is the food. It's ready. Mama, mama noodles together with pork and broccoli, surprisingly, and other vegetables. And this, first time trying this, this meal. It's kind of salad with, uh, with egg, with fried egg. First, tr first time trying this meal. Never saw like this before. Everyone is super concerned about the disease of this year, yeah, even now. Because I booked a hotel, now I'm staying in a hotel in Hong Kong and exploring surroundings. And lady at the reception said, that, yeah, many people from Bangkok, they have, they have cancelled uh, their bookings because they're afraid of disease, yeah, you know. 
Okay. Because then you... I'm a ninja. Because so many flies, I need to be ninja today. To destroy all flies. Kung Fu Mickey. I love food, love food everywhere here. Mm. Ninja, ninja. It's kind of like a really fried and an old one. December. Interesting. It's like the similar taste as seafood, spicy seafood salad. But it's made with egg. And another one. Motorbikes here are like dogs near a temple, just like everywhere, and they're barking all the time. Yeah, I gotta keep enjoying the food. And then we continue can control and then we will continue driving. Driving <laughs> to the lake. And everyone is taking a picture of this home. Why? Just a bird. <laughs> so many selfie sticks. Okay, yeah, this is a lake. Now let's find something to be excited about. No, it's not your sound. You sound like a pig. So many tents on this coast. A lot of people have come here to spend holidays in a tent. How to sleep in this cold weather? I still don't get it. Yeah, you can get a bamboo raft and explore the lake by raft, yeah. There is even person who will paddle for you. But so far it's just a place to chill, yeah, to take pictures or to enjoy the nature. I mean just sit and enjoy. Nice place for a visit. Since it's on the road, yeah. It's pretty nice place for a visit. Seen this resort. I've checked the price. 
A night in this bungalow, in this house, cost 3,500 baht for a night. A bit pricey to me, to be honest. And yeah, as you see, it's a huge tea shop. Yeah, it's a huge tea shop around the lake. Let me show you the lake itself. This is it, guys. Banrak Thai. Sanok my khap. Hello, hello. Sawari khap. Majak tinai. Hi Naina. Hi Naina bro. He doesn't even talk to me. This is the first dog that didn't re reply to me. Left me with no response. Is it possible in this world? He doesn't really care. Cars, bikes, he's the main boss here. Probably the biggest tea store in Thailand. So many tea shops. And yeah, basically this is the major attraction here. The tea shops and the hotel. And taking pictures here and buying tea. Yeah, this village has transformed. Nowadays it's really a touristy place. But it makes people feel comfortable when they come in here, right? Not everyone needs to sleep in a bungalow with, uh, with no windows, right? Some people need comfort. And this is an ideal place for comfortable traveling. For tourism, yeah. And this is the place where I'm gonna teach the food of one rock Thai. What is it? Run a hand, you like it? Pan noy, ka. Pan noy. Ah, aloy mai. Aloy ka. Okay, come from ka. Yeah, I'm gonna try your nani style noodles. Let's go. That's the food guys. As you see some kind of yellow noodles together with egg. But there is no chicken, no pork, it's just like local style, Yunnanese style noodles. I, I can't even pronounce the name of it. And this one another, also Yunnanese noodles, different type of noodles, this one already with pork. As you see, both comes together with, uh, with egg. And Chinese tea. Beautiful Chinese tea. Cheers. Mm. อันนี้อร่อยกว่าใช่มั้ยครับอร่อยมากๆครับอร่อยมากๆมากๆอร่อยมากนี่กู๊ดกู๊ดอิ่มสอดอ๋อขอบคุณครับสุดนะครับสุ
Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Man, it's delicious. Mm. It's just like like spaghetti, you know? Carbonara or any other spaghetti. I'm not a spaghetti guy, I don't know so many. I know only Bellissimo. And this is Bellissimo. Mm. Bolognese. Carbonara Bolognese. And this is real spaghetti. Chinese spaghetti. Yunnani spaghetti. Wow. Mm. <sighs> Let's try this one. Another spaghetti. Sparkling noodles. I love these eggs. They are slightly sweet, you know, really ideally balanced between sweet and, sweet and spicy. Amazing. And the prices for these noodles are about 40 bucks for one dish, for one plate. And usually, when you're visiting tourist places, if you're eating like near major attraction, the food probably won't be that tasty. But the, it definitely definitely will be much pricier. But here it's super delicious and it's super cheap for such place. Wow. Okay, guys, let me enjoy the tea, let me enjoy the spaghetti. And we will continue exploring Mehong Song, okay? Just one second, please. This is it guys, the last location for today. As you see, there is a beautiful lake with a beautiful temple on this lake. And even the night market, as you see, and I've noticed there is some street food. So we can explore it together. Street food hunt, real marketologist is back. But temple first, food is second, yeah? Spiritual food is also important for us.
พลังพลังพลังมาอันนั้นเดี๋ยวนี้พลังใครพลังพลังพลังข้าวปุกงาอันนี้เขายับเลยอันนี้อาคารในห้องสองใช่ไหมครับไม่ต้องสอนใครใหญ่ค่ะโอ้I think it's going to be very sticky. No taste at all. It's funny to we think, but there is no specific taste. Something like this, yeah. อันนี้เชื่ออะไรครับอาลาวาอาลาวาอาลาวาไม่เป็นไรไม่เป็นไรผมกินนอตอิสิตูอีดวิดบอนแฮนด์เอสอัลเวสอันนี้ซูเปอร์ครีมี่และวิ่งเดลิเชียสอร่อยครับอร่อย Really, so tasty. People are very excited to see the camera here, or me, or both. But very delicious. I recommend just ten baht. Alawa, alawa. I love alawa. This is it, guys. I really hope you have enjoyed this day, this tour around Mei Hong Song. Tomorrow will be another day. It will be new places. So, if you have enjoyed so far, hit the like button and share this video with your friends. Subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. Hit the bell to turn the notifications on. Yeah. And if you did, then make sure that you turn on all notifications. Yeah, it's very important so that you won't miss the new videos. Write me a comment, and I'll see you in the next video pretty soon. Not sure when, but pretty soon, as soon as possible, probably. Bye bye.